everyone. It's me, Keisha. And me, Chase. And Brittany. And Eric. And you're watching the Spoken Mountain Family. And today we're in the village at... At Cartoons <laughs> and Toys. It's at the very back of the village here in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. This is a must stop just about every time we come down the strip. So we're going to come in here and show you guys what it's all about. Let's get it. Oh, this new crazy mother... As soon as you walk in, you're already seeing nostalgia. So these are the pop guns, and they're $14.99. I know my brother had one of those. I don't think that's bad on the price there. They have the tie, like Beanie Boos, and the big plushy thing. The little learning mats are super cute. This Aaron's uh, Crazy Putty. This is probably one of the bigger selections I've seen of this. This stuff is really cool. Like, if you get some for your kid, you're going to play with it, too. It's Guaranteed. sort of like slime, but it's not. It's yeah. Like a putty consistency. Yeah, the, the slime they play with everywhere else is really sticky. That yeah. Aaron's putty, I like it. There's so. some poppets that are really popular. These are really cool. Jay's gotten into these. They're like Legos, but they're puzzle pieces on, like, Lego boards. They're super expensive, though. Not just here, but, like, everywhere. These little things here are deceiving you think that it's full which isn't a big box and it's not it's halfway full there's plastic in the bottom we just passed over that shark eating that person like it didn't happen <laughs> <laughs> these were cute i'm confused on what it was but i just was really like drawn to them yeah they're but, pretty cool I, I don't know what you're gonna do with those i'm gonna stick those spiders those look hands. sticky <laughs> right <laughs> Those break dancers, I don't know what they do, but I'd be interested to find cool. out. Here's some cowboy and Indian type stuff, you know, the guns. Yeah. I like the Nerf guns. That's kind of what I was into when I was a kid. Not Dustin so much was those. into the cowboy guns. Yeah. The girls was more expensive than the guys on that, and I believe the bow and arrow. This bow and arrow is super cute, but it's super expensive. It's $21.99. You can find them at Cherokee for 10 or under. Yeah, there's the, the boys. Type. They, I these love wallets these are cool. Wallets. $16.99. They have different designs. And that magic mic, though, if you all remember that, I know you do. That's $7.99. That's a good price. That. That's not bad at all. There's more Wally Crawlies again. There's a dragon, just <laughs> randomly. <laughs> there, there's the. This is like the prank section. Now, I do want to point out this. This you can buy other places. This is like, I see it at Walmart in their little bins over like $5 and under, it was $20 here. Now this light up tooth thing is uh, supposed to be something you put your, you know, when your child loses a tooth, you put it in there, it lights up and under the pillow. So that's uh, that's pretty cool. I've never seen anything like that before. It's, it's one of those things you're only gonna find it somewhere like this. Tell me I'm not the only parent that forgets to pull the tooth. And no, take the tooth back. Yeah. Like uh, tell me I'm not. <laughs> the juggling balls, that's really cool. The frisbee. When you get into the nostalgic stuff, the stuff that I used to play with, the stuff that I remember from my childhood in these stores, this is what I enjoyed the most. However, with the girls, like they love this place. Yeah. If you just seen that alien magic eight ball, it right? Than, yeah. Yeah. That's cool. This is something my grandma bought the girls and I think all of us. And it's sixteen ninety nine, the nesting families. It's really, really cute themed there, little, little pig. That's, you remember this barn right here? Now that's not the that exact one. That I had a Fisher Price just like that, but that's legit. But that reminds me. That's one of those things when I see it. It's Melissa and Doug, yeah. 50 bucks. It was heavy though. Jesus. This is Melissa and Doug like retro here. And yeah. it's twenty four ninety nine. Now Melissa and Doug's expensive. Here's the little Melissa. No matter Doug where you will get it, I, it's probably not more expensive here than it is anywhere else. No, this sure is a really not. cool puzzle map. This was cool. I just got really excited. Like the little tea there for from like John Deere, eleven ninety nine. But I mean it's John yeah, it's Deere. Not bad, yeah. Though, really. This man, okay, anybody anybody have those little flying fairies? Like you pull the string and then they fly. It almost took off my pinky. I swear I thought my pinky was cut <laughs> off. I never played with it again. That's $14.99, same concept, but a helicopter. These oh, puzzles these are puzzles. so adorable. And they're all Melissa and Doug, I believe, which is that more pricey, sturdy brand, $29.99. That's the thing about puzzle. Melissa and Doug stuff. Like, yeah, you can find cheaper like dish sets and stuff like that than Melissa and Doug, but you're not gonna find any that's that quality. You're gonna pass them down. I've scared 
Keegan with it. Keegan is so scared of bugs. Look, she was genuinely, oh, she look, was she's so mad at me. She was genuinely scared. She really thought <laughs> there was a spider. She just acted like it wasn't even happening. Yeah, it was 999 for the spider. Look at the bear. Those are all 999. I like the retro lava lamps and disco balls. A lot of the arcades have those now. There's a magnetic hangman. I didn't see that when we first looked through. That's These cool. are hard to find anymore. Briar, the Mini Winnie's blind bags. They're 499. Our girls collected those at one point. This I thought was super cute. It's a medical kit. Medical I kit had, like Fortnite? Yeah, I had something like that, but it was Fisher Price. That one was $29. I'm sure they had a bunch quality. of different types of schlikes that we don't see mm -hmm. other places. You don't see schlikes anywhere. Yeah, yeah. So these are these are pretty cool. And that, that's just a typical price yeah. for these. These are very well made too. They don't they're not plastic. They they feel they're legit. The girls were into these and you could only buy them at Toys R Us or you're gonna order them online. Yeah. And then we came here. So it was a pretty good, mm -hmm. pretty good selection. That turkey makes a That's couple cameos turkey. Speaking here. Speaking of that turkey, check out this slingshot. The slingshot ammo, different types of slingshots. I've never seen slingshot ammo sold. The problem thing with even that and the Nerf guns too, like they're really cool as long as you have the ammo for it. Yeah, as soon as you lose the ammo, it's a wrap. Sticker books here for ten there's, bucks. There's a turkey again. We've seen a lot of turkey here. We have. In We've Gatlinburg. seen a lot of turkey. These are the older cars or the metal ones. They are really nice. Like the die cast yeah. type. Yeah. I think. And here's some prices on that Aaron's Crazy Buddy. Yeah. These are all $11.99 here. Aaron got back to this. He loves this. I do. I think he likes it more than the girls. I probably do. And this is just the. Remember those Bounce, balls right yeah, there? Those bouncy balls. balls. Those are so cool. <laughs> the little llamas, I'm sure. The girls didn't see those or they would have wanted them. The tie. They've, they've switched them to these like squishmallow tie. These are the bigger ones too. He, so these were sixteen ninety nine. I'm sorry. He's I was on there. it. I was on it. He was like, but can we get one, Mom? I don't mom? know what all <laughs> these are, but it's a bunch of die casts, like putting stuff together. It's pretty cool, it seems like. I want this for Christmas for the girls. I love little crafts. Like this around Christmas time. There's a bunch of costumes lining up. So they do have an upstairs, and that's where we're going now. So Yeah. On to the upstairs. This little money. Cool. Melissa and Doug is a really popular brand here. Twenty nine ninety nine. I don't know if Melissa and Doug made that much. Though. It's like all wood. It's good quality. The, Jay has this, and yep. she has what she called the Subway Shop, and yep. it is super she makes adorable. Twenty nine ninety nine. A lot of cute stuff for babies. Yeah. How to make balloon animals. I've seen this downstairs too. Fifteen ninety nine. Those dragons look official. Look at that pink one. She's got those falsies though. The falsies. She's kind of got the resting face. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, the tea party sets. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh. 29. That's cute. These look really cool. Like you see this in Walmart, but this is like legit. Bracelet makers, 24 99 friendship. Then they have like the animal magnets, $16.99. Look at the taco and some pizza. Dora pencils. Those are your vibe. That's your jam. Dora pencils. Dora as a baby. Oh, that's a little mask for one. A horse one. The truck one. How much is that, Katie? Uh, $39.99. Hopscotch egg. Listen, Doug. $21.99. I didn't know Melissa and Doug made some. Metal tea set up here. Stainless steel. Oh, wow. Look, we got all these puzzles. Look, the 1980s American history. We got the normal horse. And then we got a blue horse. Oh, blue. Puzzles. Oh, blue. Are 23. Oh, I'm sure they're super good quality. Cereal boxes. Check out the cereal boxes. <laughs> the puffy mag the magnets with puffy stickers. $9.99. Oh, here's some tie. Baby. And it has a big beauty set there. And the big bear. Okay. So that was the, what is it, toy? Cartoons. Uh, cartoons and toys. Cartoons. It also said on the sign out there, it's also said toy crazy though. So I don't oh. know which one it is. Okay. So I'm going to swap with rating. I'm going to rate it a Sophia. I'll call nine. Just because they have a lot of stuff that you don't see, but the prices are pretty oh. up there. Um, but I understand like with the rent here, I'm sure it's outrageous. Oh yeah. So yeah, love it.
I already did it and I uh, know the reason why it's not tagged because the upstairs didn't really have that many things. It's kind of like they forced it to be up there. Like, okay, we have an upstairs, which just forced things to be up there. If they just didn't even have a thing up there, I would have given it a better rating because there wasn't too many things up there as there was downstairs. And it's about the same size too. So, a nine. I think that's why I remember. What about you? I rated a nine just because you have restocked. Okay. Yeah, they were really restocked, and every time we come here, they're not normally restocked. But I did really like the toys and stuff like and that. If That's you're on here, like on time, like when we start, like good so, for you. So the same kind of things were there last time we were there. Yeah, they were yeah. like they have like two things out of the yeah. same brand of the same toy, so. All right. Restocked. Thanks, guys. I'm gonna give it a seven, and I think that there's a lot of cool stuff in there. There's a lot of uh, nostalgic type toys that I remember from my childhood but they also it's really cramped really cramped in there and so there's not a whole lot of space and I think if the, it was just a little larger I would probably give it a better rating but still seven's a good rating there's a lot of cool stuff but that's it thanks guys all right make sure you like subscribe and turn on notifications bye